You've so, said that you think ball, ca ball caps are one of the hardest things that you have to do. It's one of the things that we do so many of. and uh, it's Now, what makes it particularly challenging? Well, because you've got to... You've got to burn the edge of. You got to put the cap on, blend it so you don't see a seam, paint it so you don't see a seam, so it matches their skin tone, and it has to stay on so it doesn't flop up. So there's a lot of steps involved, and to make it so it looks like it's skin, normally takes a long time. I think we average about 15 minutes of bald cap. In the re my record, which I just brought broke. This season, this season, this season was a four minutes. What was your four minute ball cap? It was Mikey Day, four minutes to make him totally bald, to make him bald, in a, which was crazy. It was, uh, but for years I had a six minute, six minute wall I couldn't break. Will Ferrell, Seth MacFarlane, uh, Fred, um, every it was six minutes. I couldn't do it faster than six minutes. And this last on Mikey, we did it in four minutes, which was crazy, you know. And the other big change that happened was when. Television went from standard to High HD. Yeah. That was a rude awakening. Because what we could, back in the day with a bald cap or anything, if there was an edge showing standard definition, you never saw anything. Now we've got to do everything film quality. It's got to be blended down like you would on a movie so you don't see any edges. And it changed everything. I had to come up, we had to come up with all new process of doing the paints process of gluing it down, all new, whole new m procedure when we went from standard to HD. The avatar makeup on, and again, I got myself in trouble on this one too. So we did these avatar makeups on, on uh, Nassim and on Andy Samberg. So I had to turn them both into these avatars. And it took like 15, 20 minutes to get them into the full blue, full head prosthetics. It took like 15 minutes to get them into it. And it took like, you know, 10 minutes to get all that blue stuff off. And so... I'm fine, you know, I'm like, we need 15, 20 minutes, and Lauren, between dress and air, he's like, well, what's the fastest you could do that makeup? I'm like, 10 minutes, you could do it in five. And he just kept walking. I was like, okay, I guess I'm gonna do it in five. And then like, and then I'm like, okay, well, I got five minutes to get it on, and we've got, I was like, five minutes, I've got only five minutes to clean them up and get them to look like themselves for the next sketch. And I'm telling Steve Higgins, I'm like, Steve, it's crazy. I, it's too much, too much. I, he's like, oh, we'll try it, they might be a little blue. We get them into we got we got them into the makeup in the five minutes. We got them cleaned up in under the five minutes. We're rushing. It's a tag team. It was like three makeup artists, three hair people. Everybody's trying to get their stuff done. We got Andy out. Got him cleaned up. He's out on the floor. Steve Higgins comes up to me. Goes, you, you know you screwed up, right? I'm like, what I do? He's like, Andy's the first one out there. You're never gonna get five minutes again. I'm like, oh, damn it. <laughs> Just, I, I wasn't thinking of, you know, using my entire five minutes. All I was thinking of, get him out there. And so you got penalized for I being too I got penalized for, for doing it too darn fast. <laughs> but that's, that's not what I love about the show is it just keeps you on your toes. And, and I, you kind of like, most of the people I, that work on the show, they can turn it on and turn it Like, if you can deal with craziness and mayhem, it's the place for you. And I thrive under craziness and mayhem. I, if I... If I think about it too much, I'll screw things up. If I go into autopilot, it just seems to go.